Yo guys, it's your boy Savage, and today I'm bringing you my first commentary on the channel uh, in English. So it, this might be a kind of a surprise for you. Uh, you might not enjoy commentaries in English, but uh, from now on, uh, I'll be doing my commentaries and my videos, my streams, everything will be on English. So uh, some of you might dislike it, and you will be will probably be upset and won't watch my videos again. And that's okay, I took my decision uh, to make videos in English and I can comprehend if you don't want to watch my videos in English. Uh, but yeah, uh, that's not the point of the, today's video. So yeah, today's video will be about uh, what's, what should be done to make uh, Call of Duty great again. So I, I just did this commentary like one minute ago and I... I saw that I didn't. I, I have. I had my mic muted, so I have to repeat it. But yeah, here we go. So one uh, the the big thing right now. Are, I have three big things that uh, need to be changed. Uh, trust jumpers need to be removed of the game. Uh, the, like these three things I'm gonna talk about uh, are for me, in my opinion, are no skill. They, they take no skill, and that's why I dislike them. And they don't make Call of Duty. Uh, that good. So, thrust jumpers, as I was saying. Uh, so, like these double jumps and all of that make for me the game a bit no skill. So, I need, uh, I think that they should remove the, um, these thrust jumpers and uh, just uh, the game should be boots on the ground to be, to be better, in my opinion. Uh, another big thing that I, I think they, they should do is. Um, Kill streaks. Uh, I don't like the, the idea of score streaks because people can just uh, play the objective and uh, they like, oh, I got three kills and I got reps. And for me, that's no skill. Like uh, some dudes be camping out on the back of the map with uh, their LMG and are capturing all the flags and uh, they just get reps like that and they, oh, I got 5kd camping. Oh, look at me. And that for me, that's not good for Call of Duty. I prefer like Black Ops 1 style where you just get kills, um, uh, get kills, and that would make your kill streak go up. Uh, only kills make your kill streak go up, or I should assists should count as well. Uh, that's that would be a, a good thing. Uh, and uh, like the major thing right now as well is specialists. Uh, I know there will be spe there will be specialists uh, on uh, Infinite Warfare, and uh, they're called like rigs or something. But for me, specialists are the biggest no skill thing ever. Like a dude can just go 0 and 10 on a match, and then he has his gravity spikes or something else, and he just sees you. Oh, this guy killed me 10 times. Let me just uh, push R1 and uh, L1 and get a free kill like that and that for me is no skill if I'm better than uh, this guy playing COD and uh, he has worse gun skill worse uh, I don't know he he can't outplay me and he just presses two buttons and he gets an insta kill on me that's no skill for me and I think they they should remove that from the game uh, so that's one of the big things that is wrong right now with Call of Duty those are the three major things that are wrong with Call of Duty at the moment. Um, I, I got some more uh, like opinions and things that should be in all Call of Duties, but these are like kind of extras. So uh, first thing, uh, I really like the nukes and the Moabs and camp strikes feature, but uh, I think that only infinite that infinite war thing. Uh, I think. Treyarch should do it as well, but I don't know, they don't, simply don't like that uh, that fish feature, I don't know why, but they say they don't like to put it on their games, and I can accept their their, their choice, but uh, I, I would prefer that games would have that. Uh, another thing that I would really like to see in all Call of Duty from now on is Zombies mode. I know that uh, Treyarch's zombies are always different and are the best kind of zombies, but um, Right now, Infinite War to the, took a, a step in the right direction and made their kind of zombies. I didn't like, uh, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, Sledgehammer zombies, the Exo zombies. That 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 shit sucked, dick. So, but uh, I think uh, Infinite Wards, Infinite Wards uh, zombies will be better than uh, 
uh, exo zombies. It, it won't be they won't be better than Treyarch zombies, but uh, I think they won't be as terrible as exo zombies. So uh, next thing uh, and like final thing is the the campaign. I think the majority of people uh, buy Call of Duty for their their its campaign. Uh, we might not know it because we're a community on the internet and we only know people that play multiplayer but I'm sure there are a lot of people who just buy Call of Duty for the campaign and uh, uh, at, in Call of Duty uh, the like the, the biggest thing ever was uh, in the campaign uh, aspect was that they implemented the feature that allowed us to play uh, multiplayer with four players on the campaign and that was like uh, best thing they ever did but on black ops 3 they messed up so bad on the storyline of the campaign that it turned the campaign like like shit i really enjoyed like the features it has like uh, you could uh, uh i don't know put cameras on your weapon put attachments choose your loadout whatever you had some like kind of perks i don't know you even had classes to choose from like five classes i think so that was really good, uh, but um, they, the story sucked, and uh, that made the, the, this campaign suck a little bit. So I think they should do all this uh, stuff that they did in the campaign with Black Ops 3, all the challenges, the leveling up, all of that, and the camos, and uh, I don't know what else. But um, all of that should be done, but they should make a very good storyline for the campaign. I've played all the campaigns since Black Ops 1 and I've never disliked one uh, but the Black Ops 3 one so that's like a bad thing I think so uh, one thing that I forgot to mention uh, it's that Black Ops 3 was the most complete game in terms of challenges uh, like a everything you could think about could be leveled up like zombies a campaign multiplayer and all of that all of those uh, modes had challenges and uh, the, the multiplayer had so many challenges that I think it made the game uh, kind of fresh uh, and uh, that, that for me was a good thing like I it didn't get that boring um, for a long time now it's kind of mm, okay do you want to play Black Ops 3 multiplayer mm, not really uh, so yeah that's kind of the, the bad part uh, about it but yeah guys uh, that's all for today's commentary. I hope you enjoyed my first commentary in English. Uh, you tell me in the comments uh, something like the things that I should improve, what I did uh, well, uh, video ideas you got for me to do if you want to do if you want me to do something specifically. Uh, but yeah, guys, if you are new around my uh, here my channel, uh, just uh, subscribe to me. I'll be trying to do my best. Uh, now that school is going to start and I'm gonna try to upload uh, the the most the, the most videos I can yes that's how I said I don't know but uh, yeah uh, if you like the video give it a thumbs up and uh, yeah I hope you enjoyed the, the video guys uh, see you on the next video and until next time bye